John Waters is the man responsible for making Divine a uh, movie star. Uh, she has been in his, he has been in his movies. <laughs> Female Trouble, Pink Flamingos, Polyester, and Multiple Maniacs. Uh, John's latest work is called a book entitled Shock Value, which is describes as it's described as a book that is, well, I'm a little flustered. Uh, <laughs> a tasteful book about bad taste. Please welcome uh, John Waters and Divine. This is Divine. You know, that was, uh, that's a very nice song, by the way. <laughs> Thank you. Now, Thank you let, very much. Uh, let's, uh, let, you don't, let's just start with a couple of obvious things. Okay. Um, you're, uh, you're not, uh, tell me what exactly you are. You're not a, uh, no, I don't, I don't mean that to be stupid, but. Uh, uh, I'm, I was born a male. I still, you are a male, still that's a right. Male. Yeah, yeah, I have all the, my own equipment that mm -hmm. I came with. Factory parts, uh, huh? Yeah, these yeah. are all added parts uh -huh. that come off uh, with my work clothes. Now, you're, um, uh, you're not a, a transvestite. No, um, um, I'm an actor that I specialize in women's parts. Yeah, and in all of these movies that we've mentioned, you have played Divine, is that correct? Well, no, I mean, I've played different characters. My stage name is Divine. Oh, I see, I see. And, and John, how, how did you and uh, Divine uh, meet? Well, I first saw Divine and I just thought, raw beauty. We lived in the same neighborhood. And because, <laughs> uh, to me, beauty is looks that you can never forget. And I've walked down the street with Divine and seen car accidents happen. Thank you, you look good. Yeah. Uh, now, the, 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 the new movie, uh, Polyester, I, what was your first film? Uh, the first film uh, was something that we did called Eat Your Makeup, was one of the first Eat ones. Your Makeup. Yeah. Uh -huh. uh, and then Pink, Pink Flamingos. Then we had was Mondo Trasho, Mondo Multiple Trasho. Maniacs, Pink Flamingos, Female Trouble. Desperate now, these, these are, uh, uh, at the time, and still are. Uh, cult films, uh, they play late at night and generally X-rated or? Uh, we didn't have any, there was no rating that could really apply to I see. <laughs> uh, polyester was rated R though. Now, now polyester is a departure because it's more of a commercial effort, isn't well, it? Well, yes, but I was, I had made midnight movies and they were successful and I wanted to spread my cancer to dip to a wider group of people. You see, I wanted to to spread my germs to suburbia. Now, what you know, people would think you're just being flip here about that, but what exactly do you mean there? That's... Well, my germs, what I mean by that is my sense of humor, which I find humor in all the things that are terrible about America and things that people have anxiety about. But the first step of getting rid of anxiety is to laugh at it. So mm -hmm. I think they're very healthy movies. When you say things that are wrong with America, you yeah. mean economically or sociologically? Well, I mean or... crime. There's a lot of crime in my films. And, and Female Trouble Divine plays a person that wants to get the electric chair because she wants to crime so much that that's like getting the Academy Award in her profession. I see, I see. And, and in, in the book, I think on the first page of Shock Value, you mentioned that uh, you make good, bad taste films. Well, I think there's such a thing as good, bad taste and bad, bad taste, yes. And what, and what would the difference be? Uh, well, good, bad taste is creatively nauseating, uh -huh. where bad, bad taste would be something like that film they made about Jackie Kennedy, uh, what was it called? Uh, but they didn't even show Jackie go the tycoon, shopping. Greek tycoon. So I mean, they didn't have Jackie go shopping. Mm -hmm. I thought, what was the director thinking about? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so uh, there's good bad taste and bad bad yeah. taste. And which one would divine? Divine be? is all the way good bad taste. Good yes. bad taste. And and all. <laughs> Uh, you also mentioned that to you, if you can make somebody throw up, that's like a standing ovation. Well, my early films, yeah. <laughs> because I've had theaters where they actually put sawdust down in the lobby because of that problem. But that was... One thing because of the carpeting wouldn't yeah. show the film. But that was the early films. We, yeah. we were made on so cheap a budget, $10,000, yeah. we had to get people's attention, and that was how to do it. I, you know, I, I feel suddenly like Wally Cleaver sitting here. I don't... <laughs> This is Ward and June, ladies and gentlemen. Um, now, Beaver, you better be home early tonight. <laughs> you guys were uh, childhood friends, and you must... Uh, tell me about your parents' reaction to this. Well, it wasn't too good at first, but over the past nine years, we've become very good friends long distance. They live in Florida, and uh, they love what I do now. They're, they're proud of the fact that Divine is their son. I think they're proud of the fact that I'm paying my own bills. Yeah. And, uh, <laughs> I'm not asking them for any more money. Yeah. And they're glad that I'm doing what I like to do, and I have a real good time doing it. Yeah. Well, that's But they're cool. real, they are real glad yeah. now. It took about nine years for them to come around, but... All right. We, we have to pause here for station identification. You have the biggest hair of anyone who has been on the show. Oh, good. Thank you. We, oh, excuse me. I think something's about to happen. <laughs> verily, verily... We will be back after station identification. I don't know. I don't know how it happened. 
Well, welcome back to the, the show here. We're just sitting around uh, chatting with uh, Mr. and Mrs. America. And uh, <laughs> this is John Waters, uh, the motion picture director, producer, and divine. Uh, John, uh, have you ever um, felt the need to do anything that was uh, of great social uh, relevance? No, I haven't at all, because I think being socially redeeming is so very boring. Uh -huh. You know, I, I'm, I'm just trying to make people laugh. That's mm -hmm. the only reason I ever pick up a movie camera. Yeah, and your folks, how do they feel about it? You were described as being the, uh, the prince of sleaze. No, that... I think the prince of puke. I, a lot of different... <laughs> um, I think it sort of sums it up. My mother, there was an editorial in the Sun paper in Baltimore where I lived that said the prince of puke, a favorable one. And she said, somehow when you were a child, it wasn't what we had in mind that you would grow <laughs> yeah. up to be the prince of puke. <laughs> I think they like it better than me being in prison or something, you know? <laughs> Um, I, well, I guess these are your folks here. Is that, is that yeah. John? Yeah. 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 That looks like Warden June Cleaver there. <laughs> They'll uh, be thrilled. <laughs> uh, 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 tell us about the, the, the Odorama. Well, Odorama is the, it's the film that you can really smell. And when you go, come into the theater, you get these cards, and when a number appears on the screen and starts flashing, you scratch and sniff that number. <laughs> Would you like to try one? No, I don't. Uh, <laughs> I can give you a good one first. Or... No, that's all right. That's, uh, but that's, uh, I guess, part of the uh, fun of being there. Uh, well, this has been a, a pleasure for me. I have, you both seem like very nice uh, individuals, and I want to well, wish you, you continued friend. good luck uh, in your career at Divine mm -hmm. and uh, John Waters. The movie is Polyester. Tab Hunter is in it also. Yes, yes. Thank you very much for being Thank here. You. Thank you. Stay right there, if you will. Thank you.